first day of school is just around the corner, and for low-income families, getting brand new school supplies may be a challenge. Chris Bryan explains the effort to help students in need. The start of school is just around a month away. Teachers, parents, and students will soon start preparing for the first day of school. Um, each year as students prepare to come back to school, uh, many of our students that come from low-income households and attend our Title I schools just don't have the supplies that they need. The Foundation for Springfield Public Schools works to raise money for school supplies for those in need in the Springfield School District. This year, its goal is $25,000. People to either give supplies through Ready, Set, Supply, or they can donate money so that we can support those supplies for students all across the district. If you want to donate school supplies directly to a school in Springfield, you can find a supply list on the district website for individual schools, and those donations can be dropped off at the school. It's very special to be able to do that as a family and to um, teach that to your kids at a young age of giving back to others and what a great way to do that to a fellow classmate. Whether it's in a school that you're in or a school across the district, it's a great way to support our community. Nixa Public Schools is gearing up for the first day as well. It is an event called the Back to School Bash where we help those who are needing just a little bit more or just a little bit of extra help getting ready for the first day of school. Nixa is expecting around 1,000 kids this year for the Back to School Bash. And it isn't just about getting them ready for the classroom. It is that they'll get a brand new pair of shoes, um, supplies, and haircuts that we have, and they can meet with local no nonprofits to help them tie into other needs. Nixa even has a way to help if you can only donate your time on the day of the bash. Um, and then we also do have volunteer opportunities. So anybody can come in on that page and set up for volunteer. Um, they just have to be 18 or older and not a Nixa Public Schools student. Republic will have the Backpacks and Beyond Resource Fair for those students going back to school in the Republic area. Now they also allow for people to make donations for school supplies year round through a student led program at Lyon Elementary. We'll have a link to all three of these schools inside this story at ky3.com. Now if you want to help your local school, the best thing to do is to reach out to them directly to find out ways you can help. In the newsroom, Chris Bryant, KY3 News.